Let us discuss current division rule. This rule is very important and widely used in the field of electric engineering. Actually, this rule finds application when we have to find the current passing through each impedance when these are connected in parallel. Let us say two impedances Z1 and Z2 are connected in parallel. A current I passes through the system. This I is then divided into I1 and I2 at this junction. I1 and I2 pass through Z1 and Z2 respectively. Our aim is to determine I1 and I2 in terms of I, Z1 and Z2. As Z1 and Z2 are connected in parallel, voltage drop across each will be same. Hence, we can write I1 into Z1 equal to I2 into Z2 and this is voltage drop across Z1 or Z2. As total current I is divided into I1 and I2, we can write I equals to I1 plus I2. Say, this equation is 2. From equation 1, we get I2 equals to I1 Z1 divided by Z2. Putting this expression of I2 in equation 2, we get I equals to I1 plus I1 into Z1 divided by Z2. It implies I Z2 equals to I1 Z2 plus I1 Z1 equals to I1 into Z2 plus Z1. Therefore, I1 equals I Z2 divided by Z1 plus Z2. Similarly, we can show I2 equals I Z1 divided by Z1 plus Z2. From these expressions of current, we can conclude that current in any of the parallel paths is total current into impedance of the path through which the current is not determined, divided by sum of impedance of parallel paths. Hope you got a basic idea. Thank you.